Can't wait until they find out that she took money from Saudi Arabia and other countries that treat women horribly. Here now with Reaction, author of The Death of Cool, Gavin McGinnis, Fox News contributor. Tamara is back. I, I, there's a part of me that says, oh, I love Hillary. I love Hillary. Oh, yes, we can. Obama. There's like liberals are, are sort of like zombies. They repeat what they hear, and they know. They, why did they say they'll vote for somebody and know nothing about the candidate? That infuriates me because they can cancel out my vote. Why do you actually believe the the Washington free banana peel whatever group that did this this search on Hillary Clinton? It's actually true. No, it's not true. It's a far right group that took the data and manipulated it to support their position. By the way, Who Obama is, does the same this, thing. Is and this pays where less. you guys now get your information? Washington Free Beacon or whatever? They're the ones. Anything that's reported, Hillary Clinton did this, did that. There's, there's absolutely Tamara. no evidence Tamara. of this, and it's just not true. It actually is true. No, it's not. Washington Gavin. Free Banana Peel is not a legitimate It'd be the organization. The Washington Free Beacon, which is a legitimate newspaper, yes. But right look, there's winger. different ways to look at the data. But the big picture here is women do earn less in America because they choose to. They would rather go to their daughter's piano recital than stay all night at work working on a, a, a you know proposal. What? So they end up earning less. They're less ambitious. And I think this is sort of God's way. This is nature's way of saying women should be at home with the kids. Are They're you, happier there. I, I hope that your viewers do not take you Sir, seriously. There's a great book because you should read. It's called Why Men Earn More. And it's all about women choosing to put family over work. And that's why they earn ha less. Having a choice does not mean that you're less ambitious. And your comments are absolutely deplorable. Sean, I would like less you. Less ambitious in the workplace. I would like, like to you to adjust it. I would, you're, you're a father. You have a daughter. Heroes. If you were a real feminist, you would support housewives and see them as the heroes. You and women who work that, wasting their time. You said that women are less ambitious. Women are you less have ambitious. Said, you have also said. Work. That women are better suited in the home. Yes, you've that's also a fact. said that. Uh, let's see, that women are emotional, and women shouldn't run for public office. <laughs> All of these things that just I never are said absolutely... women shouldn't run for yes, public you office. Yes, you have. You've said that. If we're that talking before. about 50 percent of the population, generally out of this 250 million people or, or 150 million people, most women are happier at home. They are pretending that they like working, and they're not making money because they don't stay all night at the office. They don't go the extra mile. Why they don't work all here? weekend. I'm You're making a mistake. Here? You would be much happier at home with a husband and children. Oh, boy. Oh, I mean, boy. I'm, I'm literally oh. shaking. You just said you're single. Oh. You don't have a boyfriend. You're what? That's you're celibate? Choice. Yeah, look, you're miserable. You would be so much happier with oh. kids around you tonight. <laughs> Imagine coming home. Mommy's home. You're you, 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 you know you what, wanna... Gavin? You're, you're not funny. You're not what you, not you do not do anything. I'm trying to make you happy. You do not do anything for the better. Sean, this yes, isn't funny. Feminism has made this... women miserable. Women were much happier when, there were, when housewives were glorified. I, guess what? I had right, a choice it. to be married, and Get I chose Tamara. not to. Right, I have a choice up. to have kids. You made a mistake. Tamara, we'll give you the last word. Go ahead. I think that your guest here is doing a disservice to all of the viewers to and to do, doing a disservice to America by saying that women, that I need to be married, that I would be happier would be at home. Happier married. That you're, what, miserably married? Just because, no, just ecstatic. having a I'm ring I'm trying on, to share my joy. I, you should see my little two-year-old. Not two -year -old. everybody He's has the same life, the life pattern as you, okay? I know, it's the fall And not everybody wants to marry somebody in a, in a bootleg seersucker suit and go home to that. I don't want to go home to that. You don't have to go home to me. Go home to a hunk. <laughs> oh gosh! Jesus! This know. is absolutely disgusting. And Sean, I, you I should actually speak you up do. for the viewers th today and I, let them know I that think, I think your daughter should have a choice. I think I think women do have, have a choice. choice. Absolutely, of course. No one's saying women shouldn't have a choice. Right, when we come that back, is... we need your help. Our question of the day is straight ahead, and I'm sure this will continue.